Welcome YouTuber Collectors This is Anubis 009 And today I present you From Transformers The Last Night Premiere Edition Voyager Hound And there is him in his packaging Very cool uh, you see a very nice artwork of Hound. I don't know, this is from the old one. But it had this uh, Gatling gun. Uh, Autobot symbol over here. They say Autobot Hound from Transformers The Last Night. And over here in the side, they say Transformers. Over here in the top, they say Premier Edition. This side of the box. Again, Transformers! And the other side of the box, again, Hound with his Gatling gun. Very cool, horrible symbol. Over here in the top, just Cybertronian symbols over there. In the bottom, just license and barcode and letters. <laughs> and in the back, uh, his uh, transformation in his military uh, uh, truck to his um, missile launcher uh, robot mode and over here you can see uh, boy her Megatron Yeah, this is the Voyager Megatron Very cool Very very nice Very cool And one thing I'm gonna tell you guys the picture, the Gatling gun, ah, the weapons are completely different. But I got to thank my friend Joe because he's allowed me to uh, borrow his uh, transformers for this video. That's me. Thank you very much, Joe. Thank you. And um, let go and open this guy and see how cool he look. And this is how the outside the box. And he look fantastic. At first I have my doubts. But he look really good. He had the lights. There you go. Over oh, here they are not painted. The windows is kind of like a blue more Decepticon kills over there really really nice very very cool this is the rocket launchers with some guns really cool over here by the robot junk <laughs> yeah very, very, very nice design. And for comparison, oh, before that, he can roll. He rolled really, really good. And for comparison, let me bring um, from Transformer the last night. Uh, Bumblebee Deluxe Bumblebee That's quite a good size Comparison uh, Let me bring From Transformer The Last Night uh, Voyager Optimus Prime Not bad at all Let me bring 
AD31 um, Leader Class Optimus Prime from Transformers Age of Extinction and yeah it's, it's more bigger and let me bring from uh, Transformers uh, Age of Extinction this is the fight the Autobots Unite fight pack Hound, really cool. I think um, not too bad. Not too bad. This green is more light. This is more green. <laughs> but yeah, really cool. Really cool. And let go and transform him. Um, the first thing is some people leave all the weapons connected but I got to disconnect it and later you can put it in the back alright here you go put it guns in this side and now so the first thing you need to do is you have two different options but first you need to take the hands let's mean first move this tab out that way you have absent you see how the bullets go inside there I know they have some people have problem put it there but you can wiggle a little bit and they connected um, you can separate this whole thing a little bit now when you have a space taking down this part and move the whole hand there you go take this from here there you go and just wiggle it out a little bit there you go that way you can take it out leaving this one like that for the moment okay see this part of the crutch there you go now for the feet you already separate them it has some tabs connect all around okay now just separate this like that and move it a little bit there you go. there we go on this whole area like that see more like that and just move this one up like that and that way you can take the whole foot area see go here like this yep, like that there you go let's so just close it and close it there you go let's say take you taking this part yes move it like that that way see then supposed to look like that now for the toe the toe see in the station like that I know it's kind of weird the way he look but yeah it's supposed to come like this yeah I don't it's, it's kind of weird 
do the same thing to the other side let's see there you go take oh, sorry take this whole area trying to move it is in a double joint there we go voila take this tab put it like that for the moment take this whole piece take this one move it like that and move this one like that that way they can like uh, connect a little bit Take this piece, move it like that. Once I find the toe, there you go. Turn around, and there we go. Now you can move this one down, and you have the legs already done moving to the top part and move this a little bit now we can move this this tab over here see this connection and that connection So this whole section move to the back something over here just in tab it move it move it to the back now move this section like this because this is gonna be the head Okay, there you go. Take this and to move the arms a little bit. There you go. Move the arms a little bit. There you go. Just position the arms. We got to work that one in a moment. Now take the head. On the head you can push this whole section and the head will be fixed. There you go. There you go. You got to hit a click and the head got to pop up. See, it's almost done. It's not complete. Okay, now this is the part. Sometimes this joint got to detach. Now for the hands, go the fingers, go like that. I said you close this. fingers go over here there you go and you close this and now for the bullets this a little bit tricky there you go the bullets that you can leave it like, over there like that in the side there you go. There you go. You can move the bullet like that and now you have free elbow there you go or if you want it you can put it more closer sometimes tricky but 
Having like that, stay in the way, the best thing is to leave it over here like that. For is with this feet, he is no very stable. Uh, there you go. Let me see if I can keep it. He is tricky. He is not. Very stable. Let's see if I can fix this a little bit. Yeah, his feet are not the best. They are very chunky. <laughs> He's not bad, but he's a little bit chunky. Uh, there you go. I think I can get it. There we go. And this is Hound in his rubber mode. And he is not bad at all. It's just some areas are his feet, they are not the most stronger feet you can find they are a little bit chunky in some way as in his eh, not bad not bad he's he is not too bad not too bad at all chunky but not too bad. Uh, let's go on. Check his face. It looked very cool. They had the blue eyes. Very nice. Now he had the vest. That's, that's cool. You know, he had the vest. Very nice. It is not too bad. Need to kind of uh, put the legs like this. That way you have some stability. But he's he's not bad. Not bad at all. <coughs> Sorry for my cough. This allergy is killing me. I think it's grass mold. No bad. Quite good details. He is not super wow. But he's not too terrible either. He had those bullets over here, and because now he had the best, very cool. You can see like a small bullet, two grenades over here, kind of like a small grenade. I don't see the the grenade. Oh, there we are. There we are. The grenade over here. Very cool. Very very nice. Not bad at all. And yes, you can take out the... <clears throat> there you go. You can take it off. The helmet. When you put it on, make sure you grab it over here <laughs> in the crutch. Because when you're trying to push it, see those two connections over there, they go over there and when you're trying to push it down he could be trying to go back too much but he's 
Not too bad. When you have the legs like that, kind of can in bending position. See, if you have it like this, it's not so stable, but you have it like kind of like this, he, he stand it up. Kind of. <laughs> not too much. For articulation, his head is in a ball joint. He can move left, right, go up, go down. The arms can go back, can go forward, can go side, south, uh, swivel, bending the elbow. Sometimes the rock, the the bullet stay in the way, and that's kind of supposed to have double bending, but the bullet stay in the way. That's mean it's a little bit hard. So it's a little bit too soft. Uh, no uh, wrist over here. Mm, that's very cool. Uh, he have a bicep movement. Very nice. Uh, his leg can go up a little bit, go back a little bit, swivel and bending in the knee. No, because you need to keep in some kind of position that way he can stand it up. It's tricky to keep him in in some kind of pose. It's not easy. There you go. And the toe can move left and right. You hold feet area. And the toe part of transformation can go down. Yeah, he's not too stable. Come on. I'm telling you, those feet, I'm not happy with that. Let's see if I can fix it somehow. Come on. Just stay. Let's see if I can fix this. Best I can put it on. Don't fell off. Stay. Stay, soldier. <laughs> now he come with some weapons. Uh, the two red thing. See. Um. You just detach it. Part. and they come with uh, two small guns very, very cool small guns you can put it over here in the hand there you go it's kind of pistol Yeah, and the other one is kind of like the rocket launcher part. Very cool. This one with that tab, you can put in his hand. There you go. There you go. Not bad, kind of cool. Uh, 
Uh, one thing you can do is in the back, you can like a storage the weapons. See, different, different pegs. You can put the small ones over there. You can put the little ones there and the big ones. Here, there you go. See, now when you can like already ready to fight anytime, and these things you can peg it right there. You know, that way you can have it kind of like a storage. See. That way he can have his weapon kind of like a hiding in the back. And you see you can have him maybe in some dynamic pose, but because his legs uh, is not too possible. It's kind of tricky. And for comparison, um, let me put him a little bit to the side. And from uh, Transformer the last night, uh, Deluxe Bumblebee. Very cool. Uh, from Transformer The Last Night, Voyager Optimus Prime. Very, very cool. And something I always want to check it out, and this is from Transformers Ace of Extinction Autobots Unite 5 Pack Voyager Hound, the old hound. And as you see, it's not bad, it's the new one, look a little bit more bulky in some way. And something cool you can do with this new one is, uh, let's see if I can take one of the guns. One of the, the guns from Hound, I don't have all out, but he can use it. See, let's see if you can put the Gatling gun. And yes, the box show like got the big Gatling gun in the picture. Looking the old hound. But yeah. That's that's kind of bad he don't he don't look like that. But for what I know, uh DR Wu got to make like a for in vehicle mode the back those rocket they're supposed to be more compact you know like a back area he got to make uh making something like that and that one transforming a big gatling gun with a belt bullet belt that's gonna be cool and i think bbts have it for pre-order I know Wen Yen, I don't know if Wen Yen with Black Apple got to make one of him. I think they had the prototype, but I hope so they don't cancel it. I hope. This is all for today. Um,
I'm glad you see my review of the premiere edition Voyager Helm from Transformer the last night. And if you want to see any Transformers, Star Wars, and sci-fi toy in my collection, you can click the subscribe button, hit the little bell for receive new updates, give a like, leave a comment, and please share this video. Every time I see more and more viewers, and that's very cool, that made me motivate me to make more videos for you YouTube collectors enjoyment. And I say again, thanks for my friend Joe. If he don't let me borrow his uh, collection, Transformer collection, this video cannot be possible. I mean, thanks Joe again. And like I always say, enjoy your hobby and play with your toy collections. This is Anubis 009 and I see you to the next time.